Thanks for joining us. I'm Fox 4 certified meteorologist Katie Walls. Looking ahead to your Tuesday, it's going to be another muggy start. Those dew points will continue to rise, especially with that warm southerly flow. Overall, though, expecting a mix of clouds and sunshine throughout the day on Tuesday. A dry radar, however, is expected. Winds could be gusty at times out of the south up to 20 miles per hour, but the very windy day that will be arriving on Wednesday. So let's break it down hour by hour right here at 7 a.m. Wednesday morning. We start off quiet, definitely on the humid side. So this is directly ahead of an approaching storm system and then still staying quiet through lunchtime thereafter. That's when a line of showers and storms will be pushing through southwest Florida, starting first in our northernmost communities and working their way southward. Now you will notice mid to late morning on Wednesday. Those winds really starting to kick up. We'll be dealing with wind gusts around 40 miles per hour, both ahead of and behind that cold front, and that's not including the potential for some stronger wind gusts in thunderstorms that come through in the afternoon and evening. So heading through your Wednesday afternoon, an evening just a heads up. We will have that line of showers and storms roll through and again an isolated strong or severe cell cannot be ruled out. Certainly something we'll be watching very closely as of now. We do have a marginal threat. That's a level one out of five threat for our northernmost communities. Of course, we'll continue to update this potential as new data arrive. Meanwhile, overnight tonight, mostly cloudy skies will kick off tomorrow morning in the mid to upper 60s. Afternoon high temperatures warming into the mid to upper 80s. Factor in that humidity, it's going to be feeling more like 90 degrees. So please keep that in mind, especially at 2 and 3 p.m. as we deal with those higher dew points, that higher humidity. Cold front comes through on Wednesday behind it. Take a look at that. Morning lows dropping with that lower humidity to wrap up the work week, head into the weekend. Likewise, as afternoon temperatures much cooler as well.